This video guide will get you up and running with Burp Suite Enterprise Edition as quickly as possible. We'll show you how to download and install the software and get to the point where you're ready to perform your first scan of a site. Specifically, this guide explains how to perform a standard single machine deployment of Burp Suite Enterprise Edition using the default settings. This configuration is most useful for trials or if you just want to see what Burp Suite Enterprise Edition can do. For the best experience, we recommend starting out on a machine with at least 8 CPU cores and 24GB of RAM. You can find the latest version of Burp Suite Enterprise Edition on the releases page of our website or your account page. Launch the Burp Suite Enterprise Edition installer in the normal way for your operating system. In the installation wizard, keep clicking next to accept the default options until you are prompted to choose a port for the web server. By default, port 8080 is used, but you may need to select a different one if this isn't available on your machine. Keep clicking next to accept the default for all remaining options until the installation process begins. Please note that this may take a few minutes. If prompted, allow Java to accept incoming connections. Once you have installed Burp Suite Enterprise Edition, you will need to perform some additional configuration in the app itself. To access the configuration page, visit HTTP localhost port 8080 in your browser. When you first access Burp Suite Enterprise Edition, you're prompted to create an initial admin user. Enter your email address and a secure password. We recommend leaving the default username as administrator. Do keep a note of these credentials. You need them to complete the initial setup and they're not easily recovered if you lose them. Click finish and login to complete the configuration process and open the sign-in page. Log in using the administrator user that you created in the installation wizard. If you've forgotten these credentials, you need to reset your password via the command line. The first time you launch Burp Suite Enterprise Edition, you need to activate your license. If you don't have one yet, you can sign up for a free trial or purchase a full license from our website. To activate your license, Burp Suite Enterprise Edition needs to connect to portswigger.net. If you can only access the public web via a proxy server, click Configure Proxy Settings to enable this connection first. When prompted, upload your license key as instructed. Once your license is activated, click Continue to begin the onboarding wizard. This will guide you through the process of running your first scan.